Hey guys, I'm back to another quick form video. Sorry if uh, I look a little weird. Just came back from cutting the grass, so yeah, it's pretty hot out there. But let's talk about Boost Mobile and the Moto Motorola Moto G 5G. It's a new phone that just came out recently, so let's get into it and see all the specs and if it's worth your money. Currently, Boost Mobile has it ten dollars off. <laughs> I mean, I guess ten dollars are ten dollars. You know, I wish it was a little bit more, maybe fifty bucks, but no, ten bucks is ten bucks. So this phone is two hundred and and ten dollars let's just say retail with ten dollar off you get it for right at two hundred dollars or one ninety nine 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 or under two hundred dollars so it says upgrade to super fast speed with the new moto g 5g with lightning fast 5g connectivity you can stream shows play games and video chat like never before discover new ways to tell your story using the 50 megapixel camera system with dual capture go for up to two days on a single charge with a 5000 milliamp battery which other phones with 5,000 milliamp battery, they last about three days, like Moto G Power, but, and leave any power worry behind. Enjoy breathtaking ultra wide views on the fast and fluid 6.5 inch 90 hertz display. Hey, that's pretty sweet. And get plenty of room to hold everything with lots of storage. Move up to the next generation with Moto G 5G. So, of course, this is a new phone. It's a Motorola 5G. It's a newer phone. A lot of other carriers will start getting it pretty soon, but I'm, I'm going to say uh, pretty fancy. Uh, 6.5 inch uh, display, of course, like I said, 90 hertz display. 50 megapixel rear camera, 48 hours of talk time, 64 gigs of storage, you know, for 200, you know, maybe 128 would be nice, but 64, I'll take it. And Android 12. Let's check out the phone. So it does look like it has a hole punch camera from facing camera pretty cool volume up volume down and power uh, i believe that is a fingerprint sensor as well let's check out the back so here's the back it does display the big 50 megapixel quad pixel uh camera big Motorola logo in the back so pretty sweet well, there you go yep as you can see that indent right there that's where you put your finger so that is a fingerprint sensor just looking at it and like i said volume rockers on the top here's the back and same thing the camera does protrude a little bit out so you probably definitely want to get a case overall i think it's a sweet phone i would say but here's features of course this is a moto g 5g so it's going to be talking about the 5g it says move up to the 5g generation download shows in seconds stream with no buffer and video chat without lag pretty cool clear shots of course it's saying whoa you can have uh, front facing and rear facing camera at the same time, pretty sweet. It's clear shots every time, sh uh, snap sharper, brighter photos with a 50 megapixel triple camera system and quad pixel technology to bring more details out of the dark. So just have three cameras as you can see, possibly be a wide, ultra wide and telephoto lens. But of course we'll see that in just a little bit. It says, and dual capture lets you shoot and record from the rear and selfie cameras at the same time. That is pretty sweet. So uh, your reactions can be part of the action. So I like that feature, really cool. So you can shoot from the front and the back at the same time. So for here, her, the model they're using, you know, she's doing a selfie looking at the cat and the cat is of course the rear facing camera, which is pretty sweet. 50 megapixel depth sensor and macro vision. So, so it looks like it's a 50 megapixel a depth sensor and then a macro uh, vision is what three cameras look like. So. Shot on the Moto, uh, Moto G 5G, so pretty cool. Look these pictures, they do look really nice. Wow, good color. I mean, I'm gonna say, pretty impressive. There's a, there you go, a lot of people like to take pictures of their dog, so it does came out pretty good. Of course, two day battery says, don't worry about running out of power, uh, work and play longer, longer three with a, 5,000 mil, uh, milliamp battery and fuel up quickly with rapid charging. So, of course, you're looking at the phone a lot. So you want to look at it. the screen. It is a 90 hertz smooth and fluid visuals, 6.5 inch ultra wide view, HD remarkable res resolution, and it's a 20 by 9 resolution. So pretty cool. Keep everything at hand. Uh, you can put a micro SD card in there. So it says plenty of room for photos, movies, songs, apps, and games with up to 64 gigs of built-in storage and up to four gigabytes of RAM. So not bad at all. 
Uh, so it looks like it is water repellent, not water resistant. So if it rains or you splash some water on it, it'll be fine. And like I was saying, always on your side, lock your phone with a fingerprint, no need for passcodes. Open a shortcut menu with a double tap. And then of course you can customize uh, your, your your Motorola with the uh, My UX control your phone with simple gestures, customize your entertainment settings, and create a look. Wow. Here's uh, some of the specifications. Uh, versatile AI camera, of course, go wide with a 118 uh, degree ultra wide lens or up to a five times closer with a dedicated macro vision camera and stay uh, ready with a laser auto focus. Advanced AI processing and four gigs of RAM, which is not bad at all. Does use a MediaTek uh, 700, so you know no Snapdragon, but you know what it is. Up to a two-day battery and a 6.5-inch HD Plus Max Vision display. Let's get to the real specs here. 5,000 milliamp uh, live poly battery, which is supposed to last longer. 48 hours of talk time, non-removable, four gigs of RAM and four gigs of storage with support up to a one terabyte SD card. Good lord. Of course, MediaTek 700 cameras are 50 megapixel quad pixel, 2 megapixel depth, and 2 megapixel wide, and a 13 megapixel front facing camera. So, pretty sweet. Of course, like I said, 6.5 inch Max Vision HD Plus LCD 90 hertz display. So, overall, I think it's a, a good phone. You know, let me know in the comments below what you think. You know, is it worth the $200? You know, it might be so let me know please come rate subscribe for a lot more videos coming your way thank you